The chief mouse halts and draws his sword and says, In that case, I have no option than to fight you to protect my subjects. The Lion King was taken aback by the chief mouse's reply. The Lion King takes his paws towards the chief mouse. The chief mouse shivered with fear but still got ready to defend himself. The Lion King said, I am so happy to see your courage and care for your subjects. Your intent to want to end this war has impressed me to let you both go. The chief mouse was so happy to hear this and said, I thank the mighty king and I hail. Will repay this kindness without fail. A few days went by. The Lion King and the Lioness were out walking in the savanna. A hunter had laid a trap cage to catch the Lion King. The Lion King, without knowing, falls in the trap. Our king! Our king! He is trapped in a trap cage laid by a hunter! We need to go and make way for his escape! his fingers towards the trap cage and said, Let's all work towards releasing the mighty king! Let's do it! Charge! All the mice started chewing on the trap cage and the cage came up. suburban town called Arthur. The town was admired by its neighbors for a big park it had. The mayor and the locals thought that the park would be more lively if it had animals. They decided to get a cute baby elephant to be the park mascot. They went to the nearby zoo and adopted a baby elephant and brought it back to the park. The baby Stay. elephant Stay. was so naughty and sweet and adorable. 
the locals and their kids brought fruits from their home and fed the baby elephant. The baby elephant Ouch. was so happy and played with the kids who visited him. One day, three little boys who were naughty came to see the elephant. They saw the locals feeding the elephant with fruits. One of the boys had a banana in his hand. The boy wanted to play a prank on the elephant. The boy said to himself, Let me place a stone inside the banana and feed it to the elephant and see what he does. The boy picked up a stone and placed it inside the banana with an evil grin. The boy gave the banana to the baby elephant but started eating it happily. The boy said to his friends, I have placed a stone inside the banana and have fed it to the elephant. All three of them looked at the baby elephant and snigger. The baby elephant, while eating the banana, bit the stone. The baby elephant was in so much pain. The boy and his friends were giggling and sniggering. They were boasting among themselves of their evil deed. The baby elephant took note of this. Since it was getting dark, the boys left okay. their homes. The 